everybody, Holly here from Holiday Any Day. And today I'm gonna make an herb basmati rice salad. Now, why rice salad? So, whenever I decide to have a dinner party, or just dinner, whatever, you know, I usually choose my protein first, be it chicken, be it fish, be it meat, whatever. And instead of doing a potato side dish, like most people do, I thought, well, why don't we do a rice side dish? And when you make a rice salad, it doesn't have to be hot. So it's a little bit easier to make ahead, and it makes the planning of the getting everything on the table at the same time a lot simpler. So I'm gonna show you how to do that today. We're gonna start with a little bit of olive oil in our skillet. Okay, okay. And this recipe, we're actually going to toast the rice up front. Just gives it a little bit more flavor. It's a yummy one, and you can do it all kinds of different ways. We're making a vegetarian today, but you don't have to do that, but we're gonna do that today. So, got a cup of basmati rice. Okay, to that, I'm gonna add some minced garlic. Let's get it till it just, just gets a little toasty brown. Not a whole bunch, it just, not, it just gives it a nice little base. So let's add a cup of water. We'll go with a cup of our vegetable stock. So it's gonna make the rice a little bit darker than it would normally be with a chicken stock. But it should give it lots of good flavor. Okay. Let's go ahead and add a little pinch of salt. So we'll bring it to a boil, then we're gonna let, reduce it to a simmer, we're gonna cover it, and let it simmer for about 15 or 20 minutes till the rice is tender. Okie doke, now it's come to a boil, we're gonna reduce it to a simmer, a low simmer, a little bit lower. Give it a lid, and we'll let it go for 15 or 20 minutes till it gets tender. Hey everybody, okay, the rice is all done cooking. We've let it rest and cool down for maybe 10 minutes or so. I've put it into my bowl. To the rice, I'm going to add some fresh chopped thyme, some fresh basil, green onions, toasted pine nuts, a little bit of Parmesan cheese, and let's give it a little zhuzh of black pepper. Smidge more salt. We'll give it a toss. Now notice the rice is a little darker than normal. It's because we use vegetable broth. Had we used chicken broth, it'd be a little bit whiter. But once again, we're making this vegetarian today. If you wanted to make it vegan, you could leave out the Parmesan cheese. Let's give it a splash of olive oil. Pretty plate. And this is just the perfect side dish if you don't want to make potatoes. And you can totally make it ahead. You could even make it completely ahead, like I would even say maybe a day ahead. Just add your pine nuts at the very last minute so they don't get soggy. Perfect for a buffet. It can sit out. It doesn't have to be hot. It can be room temperature. No problem. Hmm. So there we go. It's easy breezy.